Fly Fishing World, I'm Bill Jodropoulos, the host of the Amfish Video Fishing Blog. Taking a few seconds today on an outing out here in uh, Ontario, Canada to do a video blog on spoons. Very simple lures to use. I'm just going to step here in front of the camera with a few different ones. It's just a silver William spoon. And these two are matrix spoons. Obviously there's a size difference here. They come in a lot of shapes and sizes. Ones that are straight like this are usually tended uh, for casting. Anything with a curve like that is usually a little bit more for uh, used more for trolling. The thicker the spoon, uh, the better it's going to be for casting purposes. Thinner spoons will weigh significantly less than a thicker spoon, but the wobble on these things is actually unbelievable. Uh, very easy lure to have, very easy lure to learn how to use, and uh, like I said, just have a few of them in your tackle boxes. A variety of colors, again, variety of different sizes. I've actually got uh, a gold one here as well that I will bring up in front of the camera. Hopefully you can see that. But they're just very simple baits to use. Tie them to the line, put them on a leader, cast them out, and you've got a very wobbling action like this in the water. Uh, very enticing to fish. There's certain applications where you can use these in a little bit deeper water, maybe hook them up to a downrigger or a dipsy diver. But um, again, an amateur fisherman, to all you amateur fisher, uh, fisher people out there, pick some up, just have them in your tackle box, relatively easy, easy to use, and they will produce fish. Thanks for tuning in. See you next time.